Hello everyone, I am Dr. Srajul Afayasi. I welcome you in my YouTube channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn about some useful phrases for presentations. So welcoming audience, first point. How you welcome your audience? So you can start with good morning, afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for coming here today. Hello everyone, first I am going to talk about, then we will show you, finally we will answer your questions. So these are the welcoming audience. Good morning, afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, thank for your coming here today. Hello everyone, first I am going to talk about, then we will show you, finally we will answer your questions. Introducing yourself. Let me introduce myself. I am Dr. Fazi from Ellis College, Muzaffarpur. For those if you or who don't know me or my name, then you tell the name. Like that, you can introduce yourself. Then saying what your topic is. So let's start like that. Today's topic is today's topic is today we are going to present. Today we are going to present. The subject of my presentation is the subject of my presentation is the subject of my presentation. Structuring a presentation. I have divided my presentation into parts X, Y, Z. First, I will begin my explaining. Then, or next, we will show you. And after that, I will move on to my next point. And finally, we will answer your questions. And my presentation should take about 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, like this. Now, friends, hand out and some questions. Handout. I will be handling out copies of the PowerPoint slides at the end of my talk. And does everybody have a handout or brochures? Please take one and pass them out. Some questions like that. There will be time for questions after my presentation. If you have any questions, feel free to interrupt me at any time. Feel free to ask questions at any time during my talk. So closing, to finish, to sum up, thank you very much for listening. Are there any questions? Then speaker, now I will hand over to my colleague. Let me start. So just checklist for the conclusion. Signal the end of your talk. Summarize the key points, highlight one important point, explain the significance and make your final statement. Check list your four introductions. Welcome the audience. Introduce yourself, name, position, functions. State your topic. Explain why your topic is important for audience. Outline the structure of your talk. What comes when, say, when you will be dealing with each point? Let the audience know how you are organizing the presentation. Checklist for visuals. Prepare each visuals carefully and separately. Check whether the visuals really shows what you are saying. Make sure your audience can read the visuals font size and color, find effective headlines, keep design and content simple, use bullet chart for text, reduce text to a minimum, always prepare audience for visuals, present information clearly and logically, remember the rule of six. Checklist for using visuals, graphs and charts. Make your visuals as clear 
and easy to understand as possible. Start by telling your audience what the graph or chart illustrates. Highlight the key point, say why these points are important and explain the cause or effect. Use different verbs to express movement or development. Use the same keywords and phrases use on your bullet chart. So my friend, this point, what we have here, may be useful during your presentations. So if you like such type of video, then subscribe my channel and thanks for watching.